Do you believe the history we know might be wrong? What if I told you that a 2,000-year-old secret buried deep in the sands of time has just been revealed by artificial intelligence? Today, we'll dive into one of the greatest archaeological mysteries of all time, the manuscripts discovered in the Judean desert near the Dead Sea. And you'll see how a new force, an AI called Enoch, broke conventional timelines and forced scholars to rethink everything they thought they knew. Stay with me until the end, because what you're about to hear might change the way you see history itself. For centuries, the Dead Sea Scrolls have fascinated humanity. Discovered in the caves of Qumran in the Judean desert, they include some of the oldest known texts of the Hebrew Bible, along with hymns, laws, commentaries, and documents that reveal the spiritual and political life of a people lost to time. Since the first fragments were found between 1947 and 1956, scholars have debated when exactly these texts were written. Were they from the 3rd century BCE or the 1st century CE? For decades, paleography, the study of ancient handwriting, was the main tool to estimate their age. Experts analyzed the shapes of letters, the angle of strokes, the spacing between words, and from that tried to determine the period of origin. But this method has always had one problem. It depends on human interpretation, and where there is interpretation, there is room for error. Over the years, new techniques appeared. Radiocarbon dating, x-rays, multispectral imaging, and even virtual unrolling of scrolls too fragile to touch. Yet even with all this technology, paleography remained the key, and it remained uncertain. Only a few fragments were directly dated by radiocarbon, leaving most in chronological limbo. Then a silent revolution began. Researchers at the University of Groningen in the Netherlands, led by Professor Mladen Popovic, developed an AI called Enoch, a tribute to the ancient patriarch mentioned in the very sacred texts the scrolls preserve. This AI was trained on a set of 24 manuscript samples whose ages had already been precisely determined through radiocarbon dating. The machine learned to recognize patterns invisible to the human eye, the angle of the letters, the pressure of the reed brush, the tiny variations in ink between one stroke and another. Each scribe, even unknowingly, left a unique handwriting signature. Enoch learned to detect those signatures and link them with known dates. Once trained, it began to estimate the age of fragments that had never before been dated. In other words, a machine began reading the handwriting of ancient scribes and telling us when they lived. For the first time, paleographic dating became a kind of exact science. The results were astonishing. Enoch analyzed 24 control manuscripts and then applied its model to more than 130 additional fragments. What it discovered left archaeologists in shock. Many of the Dead Sea Scrolls are much older than anyone imagined. Texts once believed to have been written during the reign of Herod in the 1st century BCE now seem to date back decades or even centuries earlier. One striking example is the Book of Daniel. Some of its fragments, once thought to be relatively late, were redated by Enoch to between 230 and 160 BCE. That changes everything. The older the manuscripts, the shorter the distance between the original text and the copies that have survived. That means fewer layers of copying, fewer chances for alteration, fewer hands between the source and what we read today. Enoch's discovery rewrites the chronology of sacred texts and strengthens the historical reliability of passages once considered too far removed from their origins. It's as if time itself had collapsed between us and the scribes who first wrote the words of the Judeo-Christian faith. But the impact goes further. If the manuscripts are older, then our understanding of the world that produced them must change. The religious communities of the desert, 
the Essenes, the sects of the Second Temple period, all must be reinterpreted. What was once seen as a late phase of composition may in fact have been the beginning of a millennial tradition. This revelation also reshapes how we view the formation of the Bible itself. If the texts are earlier, then parts of the sacred narrative were recorded much closer to the original events. In other words, the bridge between faith and history has become shorter. Of course, not everyone is ready to accept these conclusions. Some scholars urge caution. They recognize the power of AI, but remind us that it depends on training data and well-preserved samples. In roughly 20% of the cases analyzed, Enoch's estimates diverged from human hypotheses. That doesn't invalidate the method, but it means the results must be combined with other approaches, such as chemical ink analysis and field archaeology. Even so, the direction is clear. We are entering a new era of archaeology, an era in which machines learn to read millennia-old manuscripts revealing details no lens or microscope ever could. And this doesn't apply only to the Dead Sea Scrolls. The same technique could be used for Egyptian papyri, Greek texts, medieval manuscripts, even colonial records. Think about what that means. Centuries of history could be revised not through new excavations, but through an AI capable of seeing what the human eye never noticed. Handwriting, once treated as art, has become scientific data. Picture a lonely scribe more than 2,000 years ago carefully copying a sacred text by the light of an oil lamp. His hand trembles in the cold desert air, never imagining that millennia later an artificial intelligence would decode his handwriting and reveal the exact date of his work. The machine is now speaking to the past. This discovery changes how we understand time, faith, and history itself. What was once a hypothesis has become measurable evidence. What was mystery now turns into data. And perhaps the most symbolic detail of all is the name chosen for this AI, Enoch. In biblical tradition, Enoch was the man who walked with God and was taken to heaven without tasting death. Now, 2,000 years later, another Enoch rises, not of flesh and blood, but of silicon and algorithms, to reveal secrets buried since antiquity. The line between human and divine, between faith and science, has never been thinner. A machine has rewritten the chronology of sacred texts, and with that it has opened a new page in human history. The secret of David, the forgotten scribe, the hidden archive, the truth buried by time, is starting to surface. The past is speaking again, and it wants to be heard. Now the choice is yours. Will you treat this as science fiction or as a new awakening of history? Click the link and discover how the AI Enoch uncovered the true age of the Dead Sea Scrolls and what that means for humanity itself. Research, question, go deeper. The past is calling, and this time it might not take silence for an answer.